Compressed natural gas conversion and training center in Calabar is designed to provide affordable and sustainable transportation options for the people of Cross River State. Governor Basi Otu presented that Deputy Governor Peter Ode highlights the center's role in cutting transportation costs by converting vehicles to CNG. This facility marks a significant milestone in our journey towards a more sustainable and affordable transportation system for our dear state. The rising cost of petrol and diesel has placed an enormous burden on our people, particularly vehicle owners and those who must commute to work and other locations. This project provides an alternative one that is both cost effective and environmentally friendly. That as part of our commitment to easing this transition, the government has decided to offer free CNG convention for 500 car owners in Cross River State. At the launch, Tosi Kuka representing the Presidential Compressed Natural Gas Initiative emphasizes the importance of switching to CNG to reduce Nigeria's independence on oil and to promote sustainable transportation. This new conversion center will not only contribute to the local economy by creating jobs, empowering skilled technicians, but it will also serve as a vital hub for expanding CNG adoption throughout the South-South region. Press Natural Gas Initiative was designed with a singular goal in mind, to reduce Nigeria's dependence on petrol and diesel by providing cleaner, cheaper, more, of, uh, more affordable energy solutions specifically through the conversion of vehicles to compressed natural gas. Olunda Amola Akindu Leri, chairman of the board of Bluestone Gas and Power Limited, says the facility can convert up to 40 vehicles daily. This center represents a critical step forward. Here, the technicians will receive world-class training. Vehicles will be converted and will run on cleaner, cheaper and compressed natural gas. And by converting our vehicles to run on CNG, we are not only going to reduce the cost of transportation, we will also bring down the cost of goods and services. The center will also train up to 100 technicians simultaneously, providing them with the skills needed for the transition to cleaner energy in the transportation sector. Osaroge Agwebo, reporting for BTV News.